Good morning. This is Big Lou from Florida Roadways. Oh, that's a nice Bentley over there. Looks like a late model. Um, it's been two days since I've been streaming. Uh, I've been tired lately, but I got good news and I'm happy. Finally, I got 500 subscribers. Actually, I had 501 and I lost a subscriber, so now, last time I checked, I'm back down to 500 subscribers. Uh, this is probably gonna be close to a 30 minute video. I'm just gonna go to Taco Bell. something to eat um, the weather here has been pretty good lately I mean it's partly cloudy right now the temperature is 82, 82 degrees uh, Fahrenheit
you know, it says that they're open daily from 8 a.m. to 12 a.m. But the dining room, it's not open at this time. And it's 9.32. It used to be open at around 9. But at least open the dining room at 9.30. Yes, yeah, so I'll have one regular crunchy taco and a one, uh, one regular crunchy taco okay. and a small Pepsi. Uh, small Pepsi. And a small Pepsi. Yes. All right. Any hooks out for you? No, uh, mild. Mild? Yeah. Look what they gave me. Two dollar bill. Yeah, you Thanks. Enjoy. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you. And this person that's driving the red Mercedes doesn't know how to park. Are you for real? Can't you just move up to the curb? How American of you. Okay, look at this $2 bill. <sighs> this is what they gave me when I went to CVS. So. Two dollar bills are rare in the United States. 
or in America, for those of you that don't live in America. I haven't seen one in years. I should have been drink I should have been drinking soda. But as long as my server isn't high, I have nothing to worry about. But sometimes you gotta drink something when you're really thirsty and you got a headache or you're dizzy. But when you ask for orange juice, it's they give it to you. I think they give it to you in a small bottle or something, I'm not sure. But McDonald's has a small. And I think they also have medium orange juice. Um, if not, they probably have it in just one size. Gotta eat this taco right away. Because if you eat it like 30 minutes later or more than 30 minutes, uh, the shells get soft. And that's what happened to me the other day. So. This, t this person tells me that Taco Bell is not good for you. In a way, it, it is good for you. Because look, they put cheese, they put lettuce. And what else do they put? Well, they don't put tomatoes. And cheese is lettuce is it, good for you. Ground beef is pretty much good for you. I know that McDonald's and Burger King is not really good for you, but you know. The most important thing is that you gotta eat. Going out to eat is better than shopping for clothes, doing your hair, and, you know. You only do your hair or cut your hair when you need it, not when you want to. But you can always look good when you go out. Because the ladies do it when they really don't need it. Some of them do. But they do their nails. I mean, you don't have to do your nails every week. Just do them every other week or every month. You know. And you certainly don't have to buy clothes every paycheck. 
whether you get paid every week or every other week, you know. Do that every month. From every month to every year, you know. I mean, every year, yeah, you, you gotta buy clothes, you gotta buy pants, because some shirts, some pants, some socks don't even last a year, you know, and shoes, yeah, they, they last for over a year. Not over five years. You, you got to buy sneakers every. I would say every year. To every five years, you know. After five years, you know they they usually become deteriorated. But it depends on the shoe. Look how this Mercedes is parked. And he's not even close to the parking bumper. Now that's stupidity right there. And it was hard for me to go through the parking spaces. Look at this old man with the beard. Jesus Christ, I could never grow a beard like that. I mean, he's good enough to dress like Santa Claus. I have a beard as well, but it's, it's not as long as his. It's probably about an inch from my skin. Almost an inch. But I'm gonna shave it. Probably later on tonight. So yeah, I'm so happy that I got 500 subscribers, you know. I usually gain 100 subscribers per month, but it didn't happen, so I got to work hard, and I just want to thank you guys and ladies from the bottom of my heart. But anyways, uh... I'm gonna end this video and tomorrow I'm gonna do some you know neighborhood videos but not today I'm just you know tired sorry about that you know yeah god what else do I have to talk about well I guess some of you don't like to hear talk about or hear somebody talking about politics. But I'm going to be brief on that one. You know, I heard Trump got arrested for, I can't remember, and Baden's son, Hunter Baden, was doing drugs at the White House, inside the White House. So... And 
and Joe Baden, you know, he just keeps falling down the stairs. He did that. He fell probably about three times when he walked down the stairs. It looked like he ran down the stairs. And also when he was standing, uh, what was it, behind the podium, he fell right there. I never seen any other president fall like that. But when he walks down the stairs, he just walks in a hurry. He walks really fast. And when I see him do that, I keep thinking, oh my God, he's gonna fall if he keeps doing that, you know. But his term is gonna end pretty soon. I think, yeah, next year. And hopefully he'll retire. Because he's in his 80s, early 80s. I don't understand why Trump wants to get reelected. Because Trump is, I think, 77. They both need to retire. Obama. I don't think he's retired. He's in his 60s, early 60s. So, and then George Bush, oh, well, he's definitely retired. when they have a lot of trees um, driving down this complex it's it's a good place to walk and there's plenty of benches that you can sit down and feed the ducks but I heard you're not allowed to feed the ducks because you know where I live at you're not allowed to feed the ducks I don't know why I used to feed the ducks years ago. And where I lived, you gotta you gotta walk the dog on a leash. You can't just let him walk and run freely. This park right here, when you walk your dog, you gotta, you gotta pick up your dog's mess. So. I didn't wanna show you some. These townhomes. Some of them have a short driveway, like this one right here, where the address is 8004. And you can't even park an F350. Now this Jeep right here, oh, it, it fits okay. But a townhouse with short driveways, see how the bumper sticks out over the sidewalk? That's terrible some of them are long like the suburban fits fine the 
these townhouses were built in 1968 and they range from two bedroom to four bedroom and it's got a one and two car garage they were priced at about $35,000 when they were brand new because I had a neighbor he, he bought it for I think for like almost 35 grand and it was a two bedroom but he passed away because uh, he fell off the ladder he was attempting to climb the roof but anyways uh Let me shut off this video. Uh, you all have a good day, a good night from wherever you are around the world. This is Big Lou signing off, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.